And now it's time for Mr. Fix-It, powered by your Chicagoland and Northwest Indiana Chevy dealers. Hey, good morning, Lou. Good morning. I hear we're tight on time, so I want to give you some tips on how to keep you warm this winter. Let's start with the windows. These are three very inexpensive uh, steps you can do. First of all, go on the second floor. I promise you there's cold air coming from your windows and it's because they're not locked. In particular, if you have double hung windows, that lock will help seal up the weather stripping between the two panes of glass. That'll make a huge difference. All right, the next tip requires two things you need to buy at the store a caulking rope which is made of clay and a clear tube squeeze tube of caulking i don't care what it says it just said it needs to stay clear now those drafty windows even though you've locked them you may still notice along the seam where the sash meets the frame that it's still you know air is coming through you can use the plastic film i just don't really like how that all looks and so this caulking rope comes in both a white color kind of a putty color, whitish putty, and then a brown. This particular window happens to be white. So you peel off the caulking rope. It looks like spaghetti, right? But it's pliable. And then you actually take that and you press it into the gaps where you feel the draft. Now, if the gaps are bigger, just take another piece of clay and kind of build upon it, almost like a, a school project. This would be great, Lauren, for your boys. Yeah. And, um, and they can fill in all those gaps. And you know, it's not super sticky, it's not messy whatsoever. And then once you get this all in place and you take your time, you can form it, you can shape it. In the springtime, all you have to do is kind of take a little screwdriver or a utility knife or something like that to peel it out of the way. And when you're done, you know, you can play around with it and get it as smooth as you want. I just put this here so you could see. Now, I promise you, if you put your hand there, there is no draft whatsoever. Now on the exterior walls of your home. I promise you, if you put your hands down by the base trim where that shoe molding meets the flooring, there's a draft coming through there. So I want you to take uh, some type of brush or a broom or something like that first, clean off the dirt from there. And then that clear caulking that I mentioned that you're gonna purchase at the hardware store or the home center, go ahead and caulk the trim to the floor. Now, as this is going on white, you're gonna be like, oh my gosh, it's a huge mess. No, no, no. Just go ahead and put a nice bead down there, fill it in, and then take your finger to make it nice and smooth. When this dries, it will dry clear and you will not see it whatsoever, but it will keep the draft out. And look, when it comes to really, really cold weather like we just had, you, you know, all of us were feeling drafts that we never even knew existed anymore. And if you do these three things, uh, I promise you, you will be warmer when that next really cold, cold snap comes our way. Right, thank you, Lou. You can check out House Smarts on Saturday afternoons on WGN at 3.30. Lou is also 